just wanted to do a review of this, uh, these awesome uh, little engine set this up thing here. Had these for about six months. I actually used them quite a bit to uh, diagnose different engine noises like, um, you know, when I thought I was actually having, in one of my previous videos, like the bearing, I wasn't sure if it was a bearing or transmission or what it was, but I actually have one of those uh, old style stethoscopes. Um, you know, like the old engine, uh, let me grab that real quick. So yeah, I do actually have one of those uh, old style stethoscopes here. And they actually do work pretty good. But they're not nearly, it's kind of hard to pinpoint exhaust leaks, you know what I mean, in certain areas. But let me show you these. I think these are, I'll give you the direct price, but these are like, like 60, 70 bucks on Amazon. And they're like an electronic stethoscope. And it comes with the uh, earphones and like a probe. And this is the actual heart of it right here. It's basically like a, it's a hole in there. You can stick the probe in there, but um, has a mic or headphone jack right there. And it's basically like an electronic microphone and on and off. But yeah, it's crazy the kind of detail you can get with this thing. So if you really are having issues uh, trying to figure out like something going on with the engine knock or bearing knock or like for me, I'm a, the reason why I brought these out right now is I'm looking for an exhaust leak uh, in my headers and the problem is it's the side that has my O2 sensor on it. So um, I'm just trying to figure out, I'm definitely getting some kind of backfire going right now. Like I'm definitely getting some kind of air in the exhaust, but plus I can hear it like when I'm facing against a wall. So I think it's a header leak somewhere like in here, but somewhere I think in there somewhere but I'm gonna use these uh, Steelman ears to see if I can figure out I think I know where it's kind of at I did this before in the past but today I think I'm gonna take the header off and uh, I mean I don't know if these headers are warped but I seem to have actually had a lot of exhaust leaks on that side so I might try some uh, exhaust sealant maybe like the RTV sealant that's like a heat treated or like the copper seal where the hell it's called um, but yeah, these things are pretty awesome. It's like, uh, I, I guess there's no way I can really put this into my phone so you can actually hear it. Um, because I don't think my cell phone, my cell phone doesn't really have a mic on it, so. But yeah, these are awesome, man. If you can, if you can afford a pair of these, I mean, this, these are definitely uh, pretty cool for diagnosing noises, you know. But just trying to figure out a way I could get this thing on my phone so you can hear it. But, all right, cool. So, um, I guess this is kind of a shitty review, but yeah, these are pretty cool, so. All right, guys, so by using the still ears, I can, I don't know if you can hear me, but you got my, I have a headset on, but it sounds like it's coming from this header right here. You can see that, maybe. Definitely tell me it's coming from this area right there. I guess that's number uh, three, still number three uh, on a Ford. Somewhere in it. Definitely, I think right there, still number three. Alright, cool. I think I figured out where it's at.